Now in this video, I want to show you something quite remarkable. We've got the Panasonic projector sitting on the ground there. And we've got uh, two surfaces that we can use to project onto. Now I'm just going to uh, go and play the video. And you'll see the um, video faintly appearing on the bottom white screen. And uh, so there we are, it's starting to play now. It's a Lindsay Sterling uh, music. And uh, out in the countryside with her violin. Now, you might be able to see something there, uh, very faintly. Um, certainly you wouldn't want to be showing that to a client at all. And certainly you wouldn't be able to charge them for your surfaces outdoors if this is what you were showing them uh, that you could do. Now I want to show you something that you probably don't believe um, is actually possible and you probably think I'm uh, exaggerating the truth a little bit here. Now we're under a uh, sort of a cloudy sky, it's been uh, cloudy on and off today as the blue sky appears and then disappears but let me just span, go up and you can see. So that's the environment we're under here. I'll just tilt it around a little bit so you get a bit of an idea. So there's no hard shadows on the ground, it's all uh, just the same tone. And you can see, so now what I'm going to do in real time, I'm going to make that image fantastically bright to the point, it's what I would say is a perfect image outdoors. Now this is not going to work if the screen was facing directly into a blue sky sun with the sun directly shining straight at it. It's not going to work with the projector that we've got here at the moment. But in this environment, and can even be brighter, um, we've had it a little bit brighter this afternoon when there's a lot more blue sky, um, perfectly acceptable image. Now the projector is a relatively bright one at um, just over 8,000 Nancy Lumen, but uh, we've had the smaller 3,500 Lumen out today and you can certainly still see a picture. So um, let me show you the difference. Now the difference you can see there I can imagine you actually don't think it's possible. Now just let me realign that projector a little bit. And that's a lot better. So um, this image here now we're seeing is uh, what I would say is um, a perfect image. Now if I can uh, zoom in and uh, probably lose our focus a little bit I think and I might just take the camera in again and try and do it all in real time and I think that focus is better there now again sky up here come straight back down and let me just uh, out on the angle here. I mean you shouldn't be really asking anyone to look at a projected image from this angle but hey, in this case we can still see an image and uh, let me just take you around the back. So uh, that's the structure what it looks like from the side. We've got it on our floor stand and uh, take it around further and you can see. So um, this is what I wanted to show you in this video. Most people will say that is impossible to achieve. Notice there's no power cables on the ground at all. And so that is the uh, digital daytime screen. Thanks for watching and uh, contact details on the video, on the edited version and on the accompanying text. Thanks.
for watching and trust you found it helpful.